Today's video is sponsored by The Forge for all your hobby nerd needs. Whether it's Warhammer 40k, Age of Sigmar, Marvel Crisis Protocol, Magic the Gathering, Pokemon, Lorcana, and a plethora of board games, The Forge has what you need. The Forge has been my go-to shop and the inventory has only grown. If there's something you don't see on the shelves, fill out a product request form on their website. Thank you to The Forge for sponsoring this video. My name is Tattooed Tabletop, and today we are looking at the new Harder and Steenbeck Special Squidmar Edition Ultra Airbrush. First things first, let's get this sucker open. So I ordered this as soon as I saw it because it looked idiot proof, and I do end up doing some airbrushing, but for the most part I use it for priming, and then some Zenithal, but for the most part I want to step up my airbrush game, so I went to the masters at Harder and Steenbeck. What a smooth case, how lovely. Now, let's crack this thing open. Oh, oh yeah, this is a step above. Oh, watch out. Look at that nice card, ugh. Such charm consists, don't look at that, that's mine. Or maybe it's not, who knows. So we're gonna take a look at this airbrush and this thing is gorgeous. I mean, it's just, ugh, you feel so powerful. When you press down, you pull back, gotta love it. Great design. I mean, I remember watching some of the videos that was coming out about this and I just couldn't help but notice that these were designed with such great intention to make airbrushing infinitely more approachable. Let's adjust the light there, get a little better. So you can see the settings on the side, including prime, base, and then it says in Roman numerals one, two, three, just letting you know what layer you're on. So in that way, when you press down and pull back, you're stopped right where you need to be if you're priming stop if you need to be basing and so on and so forth the the design of this airbrush is just absolutely top notch i i'm really excited to dive into this and the design is so beautiful and you just take the little cup there gravity fill and just stuffs right in now i do this a couple times because i try to put it straight in and I'm like oh no it's not working i wonder why well because gravity needs to work and not straight down you idiot there you go through the side perfect just nice gravity fed, push down and pull back. This is an absolutely fantastic product. I can't wait to start using this and I promise I'm gonna get this thing out and try and do some models, see what I can show you, but well worth the investment. Well, and whoop, what is, I don't know what, maybe the needle goes, I don't know what goes there, but anyway, you just take the cup off, set it down, or if you want to, you can leave it in. There's actually grooves in the top cap for that as well. No, James, you put it in. There you go, you big dumb boy. All right. Well, until next time, I've been Tattoo Tabletop. Go paint something.